This is a video about proper fuel management on the Kapalua. To start out with, the port tank is filled here, starboard tank is filled here, this is the toy tank that sits right here that you can't look into, and then this is the toy tank that you can look into by taking this cover off and you'll know how much fuel you have. The key to proper fuel management lies in which tanks you pull out of first, and they don't change automatically. So you need to be aware of that. The other thing to be aware of is the generator pulls only from the port side tank. Because of that, the way you want to pull fuel is first from this toy tank, then from your starboard tank, and then from your port tank if you're pulling that much fuel. And you can pull everything down if you save this tank as your last tank to pull from so that you've got 90 gallons of fuel you can pump into the port side tank and the starboard tank to get you back home again to power our two engines. Now, the way you control where they pump out of is by turning these quarter turn valves that sit on the top of each tank and they look like this. It'll be hard to give you a good picture of what they look like for the other tanks, but this is the one for the toy tank that you can look into. Turned like that in line with the tubing means that it's open and ready to pump from. Turned like that means it's shut off. So again, if you want to do it the right way, you'll have it turned like this for the valve that sits on the other toy tank that you cannot look into. We'll try to get you a picture of that. And turned like that on the other three tanks. And then as you pump out of and, and empty that toy tank, you'll turn that valve off, turn the starboard valve on, you'll pump from there, and then if need be, you'll empty that tank, turn that one off, and turn the port side tank valve on, and you can fill from there, leaving again this tank as your very last tank, as a last reserve to be able to get home on. Let's try and get you a picture of each one of these valves. So, for the starboard side tank, the valve is right back here. So if you can't see the valve, hopefully you can at least see my hand. It turns like this to turn it on, and like that to turn it off. The toy tank, again the valve is here, like that to turn it on, like that to turn it off. And then the port side one I can see right here. The port side. Look right here. Turned off. Turned on. And that's it. If you manage your fuel that way, you're assured no matter how far up the lake you go, you will have enough fuel to get home because you'll have the 90 gallons that are in the toy tank you can look into and confirm that in fact it is full before you ever leave port. That's how you manage fuel on the Kapalua. And to know how much fuel you've used, we installed a not so easy to get out, but we've installed a fuel gauge and we'll show you how that works. So here you are. As you can see, we've recently pumped out about 76 gallons of fuel. We'll clear that, and the way you clear that is you just push this button and hold it, just kind of like your trip meter on your car, and you see that it clears. That way you can know how much fuel you've pumped off each time. Or if you want to do cumulative, just let it crank the entire time that you're out on the boat, and you'll know how much fuel you've pumped off. And that takes care of it. And obviously you know where you turn it on, you know how the pump works, and there you go.